trips with us and obviously they do all our filming for us and then of course they bring these guys food after games too which is totally unnecessary but I'm sure much appreciated. So we appreciate everything that you've done for us. Ryan Paul is the next senior that I'd like to acknowledge. So Ryan if you can like stand out there in front of everyone so we can embarrass you. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. So as a freshman, Ryan decided to start up this little deal. I think it was your freshman year, correct, Ryan? Yeah. So he started up this deal, um, and back then he did a lot of stuff for just the freshman team, and he was in the Augs gym, and he has since turned it into the Chaska, Bra or the Chaska Broadcast Network network which many of you I know when you're out of town whatever um, when you don't feel like driving through 10 inches of snow to the gym um, you you've tuned in and you've listened to his broadcast um, I have coaches all over the state that have asked me how we did this and who did that. I've done nothing with this I have had absolutely nothing to do with this this is totally a Ryan production he is he's run it since he was a freshman and he's taken it over and he he has like a staff and he, I've got, I got a brother that lives in Dallas, Texas. He tunes in for every game and then texts me at halftime and tells me things going on wrong and all that kind of fun stuff. So we appreciate you so much, Ryan, for what you've done. And um, I, you, if you ever see him getting on the bus, it's like he's going on a three-week vacation. They got like suitcases, tables, the whole nine yards. And uh, he also put together the video that we're going to watch in just a couple minutes. So I think Ryan deserves a huge round of applause. You can stay out there. All right, and we have four senior basketball players on this year's team. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to introduce them one at a time. They're, they have a flower for their mother, and then they're going to give their dad a hug or however they want to do that. So the first person that I'm going to introduce is Peyton Ayers. Peyton's parents are Carrie and Chad Ayers. The second senior I'm going to introduce is Mark Newman, and Mark's parents are Becky and Bob. Becky and Bob. Our third senior that I'm going to introduce is Connor Kranos, and Connor's parents are Rhonda and Kevin. And our last senior that I'm going to introduce is Cole Nicholson, and Cole's parents are Kristen and Scott. So first of all, to the parents of the four seniors, I was in your shoes two years ago. It was kind of bittersweet because I knew I was going to get a little lighter grocery bill in the, in the near future. But we appreciate everything you've done from the time you started carting these guys around uh, to all the traveling tournaments, gotten up for the 8 a.m. games and driven all over the place, all over the Twin Cities. We appreciate all your efforts. And most importantly, you've raised four absolutely spectacular guys. So on the basketball court, what we have with these four guys, just to give you guys some, some records, currently we're 18 and 5 this season, 10 and 1 in the Metro West. We're going to have a great game tonight with St. Louis Park, um, and we are uh, we were 20 and 8 last year, um, and the year before their sophomore season, we were 24 and 7. We won the Metro West. We won the Section 2A title. Had an opportunity to go play on the Target Center floor. Many of you, I'm sure, were there or watched it on Ryan's live. No, we couldn't live stream that one, could we, Ryan? Yeah, they wouldn't let you. Um, but the biggest thing about these four guys is it's absolute team first attitudes, team first attitudes. We have four guys out here that they'd much rather walk off the court with a win than worry about their own stats and their own individual accolades. They don't care about that. They would much rather win the game. That is their focus. That's been their focus their whole careers. And so for that, gentlemen, we thank you very much. We wish you, as a coaching staff, we wish you the absolute best of luck. I know you guys are going to do great things in college, and you're going to tear it up, and you're going to have a blast, and you're going to come back to games, and we're going to, we're going to be lifelong friends, hopefully. Okay? So we have this wonderful video by Ryan here. I haven't seen it yet, so I'm excited. If you can turn your attention to the video screen. I can still find Wiley's house Riding on my bike with eyes closed I could name every girl that he took out 
from my memory dial his house phone Can you take me back where we were just kids We were scared of getting older yeah There's no one knows you like they know you and no one probably ever will You can grow up make new ones but truth is nothing like old friends is you can't make old friends yeah I still feel the windows down listen to Jimmy eat world ride in three wide on Blake's bench see yeah my guy in 10 years now I would have his back tomorrow and he'd still fight anyone who tried to touch me can you take me back where we were just kids who weren't scared of getting older yeah there's no one knows you like they know you no one probably ever seen their parents back porch it wouldn't change how things turned out but there's no one in this time zone who knows what in line skates that I wore can you take me back when we were just kids We're in scared of getting older There's no one knows you like they know you and no one probably ever will You can grow up make new ones but the truth is that we grow up then wish we could go back then there's nothing like old friends. You can't make old friends Six, three, four, and number thirty-three, Mark Nichols. 
Am I good? I'm gonna turn this off now. <clears throat> Are you good with that?